Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for coming through. If you're new to my channel, my name is Naka Friedel, AKA Naka F, and I welcome you all to my channel. Um, so I'm just gonna say it, just in case you notice, um, I went a little heavy on the blush today. Um, I tend to go overboard a little bit whenever I do my makeup and I'm not wearing contacts. I just tend to do something it, it could be my eyebrows are too thick or my blush is a little heavy i tend to do something because i don't know i'm just not seen properly whatever the case is but i'm okay with it um just in case you happen to notice um okay so as you guys can tell from the title of this video um I ordered my first ever pair of Yeezy 500s. Actually really, really happy about this lip gloss. It's the Fenty Beauty Hot Chocolate. I wasn't sure I was gonna like it on my skin tone, but I actually really, really messed with this. I really, really like this a lot. Interestingly enough, on the 700 Salt unboxing video, where that was like the first and only pair of sneakers I've ever purchased on StockX, Someone, um, I happened to start talking about the 500s in that video and how it reminds me of dinosaurs. And someone happened to comment recently, maybe about like a few days ago, about what am I talking about? Where does dinosaurs come from? Um, and then I sent them a dinosaur emoji because I just, I just personally feel like that's what it reminds me of. I just recently cut open the box. Here we are. So here are the Yeezy 500 uh, Tyrians, I believe they're called. Um, yeah, so I got them, so they're the high. So the other 500s had come in like a, a regular, like low, um, low ankle sneaker, but these are the highs. All right, and I also got this in a size six. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna do a quick unboxing for you guys. I wasn't sure if I was going to order them when I saw that they were coming out, but for some reason they gave me a lot of beef and broccoli vibes. So if anybody who doesn't know what beef and broccolis are, those are the Timberlands that came out, have come out several, several years and several, several years ago. And they were uh, a nice chocolate brown with a uh, green, uh, insides or inner areas and they were always called the beef and broccolis and so that was the type of like nostalgia that it gave me um so I was a little bit more interested in purchasing them even though these are brown and navy blue um that was just the vibe it was giving me and I was just like you know what this would be my excuse to try the 500s even though I'm not the biggest fan of them um, okay, so we're gonna just quickly get into this unboxing and then we can talk more about it. Okay, so here we are and here is the 500 uh, box. I got it in a size six, which I mentioned earlier. Um, so let's see what it looks like. All right. Um, okay. All right, so here is the sneaker. Um, as you can see, it's a high top. Wow, they look very combat booty. Let me just, I'm gonna take both of them out today. Okay, so here we have both pairs, uh, both, both pairs, uh, both feet of this pair. Um, again, they look very combat booty, so Definitely a sneaker that I can see myself wearing a lot in the winter. Um, they seem to be very well like insulated. And I mean, in my opinion, they still look weird, uh, but I do think they look a little less weird than the low top ones. Had it been low top, I wouldn't have checked for these at all. Um, okay, so that's what the sneaker looks like. 
Um, this is uh, the upper suede um, and this material is a little bit, I think it's neoprene. Um, neoprene is usually like the scuba material. So that's what it kind of feels like. Um, but the brown part is suede. Um, I feel like on camera it looks a lot more of an ashy brown, but it is more of a chocolate brown in person. Um, okay, so the back, so the Adidas sign is here. Um, and what is this called? Adipreen. Um, Adipreen. So is that neoprene? I don't know what that means. I'll have to look it up. Um, but it says Adipreen here on the side. Make sure you guys can see that. Okay. All right. And then you have this, um, I guess, I don't know what this is. I don't know what to describe this, but this is how the laces come. And I guess you kind of just like pull it in to make the ankle tighter, which I think is a good, a good thing for more ankle support, especially if it's a high top sneaker. I love ankle support. Um, again, I love comfort. That's what I really mainly buy sneakers for at this point. Um, and yeah, so this is what the sneaker looks like. We're going to get back to my face and we'll just finish out the video, just doing a little brief discussion about these sneakers. I did want to um, just make it known that this time I ordered these sneakers on adidas.com. Um, so they had like a drawing and I just put my card number and everything in the case that I won the drawing that they would just charge me. Um, and I kind of wish I would have just purchased it on Yeezy Supply because this took crazy long. Um, I believe, when did these come out? These came out like two Saturdays ago. So like May 16th, this came out and I didn't actually get these in the mail until yesterday, which is which was May 27th. And that's crazy when literally for the other sneakers, the V3 700s, I ordered them on the 11th of April, got them on the 14th. So um, maybe Adidas and Easy Supply have switched places in terms of their urgency and their shipment. And I honestly don't think there was much hype and much desire for this sneaker in particular, because even um, when I looked on Easy Supply, Later on in the, in the day on May 16th, when these dropped, um, everything was still available. My size my size was still available and everything, um, but I decided I wasn't really gonna go for it on Easy Supply in the case that I happened to win the drawing. I wasn't, I didn't wanna be charged twice. Like, no, that's way too much. Um, yeah, so again, just looking at these sneakers, I feel like these look better, again, than the low top version of the 500s, but this is still giving me dinosaur vibes. And like when the person who recently commented, I don't remember his name, um, when he recently commented like, what are you talking about? And of course that's the voice that I heard in my head when I read it. What are you talking about? Where do you get dinosaur from? Da, da, da. Uh, well, this just gives me dinosaur vibes. Am I not, am I the only one who just, this screams dinosaur? It screams dinosaur. I can't be the only one who thinks this when they look at the Yeezy 500s. Screams Jurassic Park. Am I wrong? Comment down below if you think that I'm bugging. Um, and I'm excited to wear it when it gets colder. I'm probably not gonna wear it anytime soon and obviously like, we're still kind of like not going outside, um, but I wouldn't wear this in the heat. It's too hot for that. Um, okay, so I hope you guys like this video. If you did like this video, please do not forget to thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, please do not forget to subscribe before you leave because I will be coming with more videos very, very, very soon. Thank you all for your love and your support, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.